And how often have you heard this? The very moment your friends find out you're afraid to fly, they will kill you with logic. They'll go, uh, you know more people die in car wrecks than they do plane crashes. I go, so? That's the way I want to go. Damn car wreck. Where I'm from, it's kind of like a tradition. Really, we don't have heart attacks in my family. We just hit damn trees. Usually on the weekend. Just out drinking. Well, say folks, think about this. At least if you die in a car wreck, it'll give the kin people something to talk about at the funeral home. Have you ever noticed that when someone passes away the result of an auto accident, at the funeral home, they won't talk about the dead guy, they'll talk about the damn car. They go, uh, did you see the car he was driving? You ain't seen it. Why, it smashed all to hell. <laughs> they still ain't found the steering wheel. <laughs> Why, you can't even tell what kind of car that is. Yeah. Well, I know what kind it is. I'm one that had to co-sign for the damn thing. <laughs> I mean, I know he's dead and gone. I ain't gonna stand out here and talk about him. He never did have no credit. Everything he had was a cosign. And don't don't let this go no further. But his house wouldn't even in his name. Hell no, his daddy bought that damn house. <laughs> and besides that, folks, at least if you die in a car wreck, they can always retrieve the body. And we need that, because I'm Baptist. <laughs> you give us something to embalm and some tater salad, we can have a funeral. <laughs> This ashes in a urn ain't for us. Oh, hell no, we're gonna throw dirt on somebody. <laughs>